हेलो एवरी वन दिस इज अभिजीत एंड यू आर वॉचिंग माई यूट्यूब चैनल ए बी स्टडी सर्कल डू लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब टूडे वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट ए न्यू सब्जेक्ट दैट इज थर्मोडाइनमिक्स थर्मोडाइनमिक्स इज बेसिकली वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सब्जेक्ट रिलेटेड टू मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग सो लेट्स स्टार्ट बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द सब्जेक्ट we should understand what is the aim of the subject why we are studying aim to understand the concepts related to converting disorganized form of energy to organized form for example heat to work where heat is disorganized and work is an organized form of energy so as we understand that why we are studying thermodynamics because whenever we have to apply a concept related to thermodynamics in a area where we want to convert disorganized form of energy to an organized form of energy we have to apply thermodynamics and thermodynamics to apply thermodynamics we have to know about the subject let's move further and now we want to define thermodynamics thermo dynamics basically it is a summation of two different terms thermo and dynamics where thermo means energy and dynamics means motion so we can say that thermodynamics is nothing but it's about the motion of energy right so we can define it in this way it's a science of energy transfer and its effect on the properties of a system now you will ask me what is system system is nothing but the region in space on which we are studying or applying the thermodynamic concepts for example if we talk about this uh, pen it's a object in space and if we think or apply thermodynamics we want to know about its temperature at a particular time or at a particular uh, surrounding so other than this pen we are not interested in studying but we are interested only on what is happening to the pen when 
the surrounding temperature changes otherwise right so we can define system as it's a reason in space where our study is focused now as i said that when we are supposing this pen as a system and other than this as a surrounding so we have to define what is surrounding anything external to system anything external to system is known to be surrounding right now another term has been universe it comprises both system and surrounding that means we can say universe is equal to system plus surrounding now as we define both system and surrounding now you will ask me how you separate system from surrounding there is one more term known as boundary it is the reason which separates the system from the surrounding and it can be fixed or movable how it is fixed or movable i will discuss it in my further videos now as we define as we previously defined system there are different types of systems there are three types of system namely closed system open system and isolated system why they are known as closed system open system or isolated systems are such that how they are interacting with the surrounding in the three types of systems as i mentioned closed system open system and isolated system there are some uh, properties which are restricted to interact or allowed to interact with the surrounding then accordingly the systems are named as closed system open system and isolated system let's explain it types of 
system. Closed system. Open system. And third is isolated system. In closed system, mass is restricted to cross boundary, but energy is allowed. To cross boundary. Whereas in open system, both mass and energy are allowed to cross. boundary and what is isolated system the isolated system is that when both mass and energy are restricted to cross boundaries now you will ask me is there any type of uh, practical systems available which will differentiate between these three different types of systems firstly closed system open system and isolated system for example, for closed system, example for closed system is piston cylinder arrangement without valves means when a piston cylinder arrangement is there like this and there is no valve here there is no valve in this type of system is in closed system in case of open system all mechanical equipments are example of open system all mechanical equipments it can be your turbine compressor piston cylinder arrangement where valves are there like your engine arrangements in your two wheeler bikes or cars isolated system isolated system the best example is universe because everything happens inside the universe means mass or energy is interacted between system and surrounding and nothing goes outside the universe everything happens inside the universe means the universe nothing is interacted from the other universe to this universe right 
और प्रैक्टिकल एग्जाम्पल ऑफ आइसोलेटेड सिस्टम इज वेल इंसुलेटेड फ्लास्क फॉर एग्जाम्पल द फ्लास्क विच आर यू आर यूजिंग फॉर मेंटेनिंग हॉट वाटर और कोल्ड वाटर वे हॉट वाटर इज नॉट फ्लोइंग आउट ऑफ द वेसल और द टेम्परेचर इज नॉट cooling down that type of system is a isolated system so we have discussed about types of system boundary universe surrounding and we have also defined and why we are studying thermodynamics in our further videos we will discuss more on this topic of thermodynamics till then good bye and if you like my video please do comment like share and subscribe to my channel that is ab study circle thank you